the hydro system is the envy of North America. We are very blessed to have such a phenomenal resource that British Columbians have invested in. And I love the fact that Site C is coming on. It's much needed. And I wish we had more Site Cs. So what do you do when you have more renewables and you have dispatcher resource and hydro that also can be subject to weather events? You start to think about how do you utilize those systems so that you're preserving water behind the dam while you're bringing on more renewables. It really becomes an operational challenge. There are things you can do. The call for power that BC Hydro has put out does have some benefit if you can keep water behind the dam for the winter. But the reality is in very extreme weather events, we've had three winters in a row where we've seen colder and colder winter spells, right? Before you see a one in 10 year event. Now we've had three consecutive winters where we've had those really cold spells. And if you get into not an annual cycle of drought, but a seasonal or a cyclical, cyclical drought, not seasonal, like you had in the Colorado River, you have to play catch up. And that's where you put more uh, strain on uh, the capacity of the electric system.